Well, it has been a long time coming. She Tech, remember that? Uh, the Women's Tech Council's program to introduce STEM careers to high school age girls. It is back. It is in person for the first time since way before the pandemic. I think it's really, really important for sh that She Tech shows these girls that we can do these amazing, we can take part in these amazing tech fields. That is Sarah Greer, local high school senior who has participated in SheTech for the last four years. And it's young women like Sarah who are getting the word out, increasing the number of female tech titans of the future. As of today, there are five times as many men in the fields of engineering, and not quite a third of the tech jobs in the country are filled by women. Meeting face to face with industry professionals, the whole she tech experience, it's necessary to grow those numbers, according to organizer Sydney Tetro. It changes how you see what you can become, and that's what makes a meaningful difference to pipeline girls into STEM. Here's the information you need to know She Tech Explorer Day is tomorrow, 9 in the morning to 1 in the afternoon at Mountain America Expo Center in Sandy. You register at SheTechExplorer.com. The reason I brought you that information today instead of tomorrow is because it helps to register. Your teen would want to check with their school. They likely have a bus already going, so uh, you want to make sure that you align with that this year. In addition to the industry professionals, Governor Cox will be there to talk about Utah's tech industry. Of course, we want as many young women to get into those fields and to stay home, to stay here in Utah for schooling and for jobs and to stay here forever. So uh, Silicon Slope certainly looking at SheTech and those young women in those careers. You want that